What's up, Juba people? Welcome to this lesson. Today we're learning Photograph by Ed Sheeran. Sheeran's. <laughs> okay. Loving can hurt. Loving can hurt sometimes. But it's the only thing that I know. Then it loops E, C sharp, minor, B, A. Sometimes, but it's the only thing that makes us feel alive. Ooh. And then the pre chorus we keep this love in a photograph, we make these memories for ourselves. But our eyes are never closing, hearts are never broken, time's forever frozen still. Chorus, so you can keep me inside the pocket of your jeans, holding me closer to the eyes of me. You won't ever be alone. Wait for me to come home. <laughs> okay. So, so this song is obviously a really fun song to play and sing at the same time. Really nice song. Got a nice, uh, it will teach you a lot of nice open chords in the key of E, like E5, C sharp minor 7, ooh, B, ah, A, and a nice, another type of C sharp minor. Um, a nice B. So a lot of cool things with learning a song like this that, that can really help you with a lot of other songs and maybe writing your own music and that kind of thing. So let's jump into the parts. Okay, we're going to start with the main progression which is used in the chorus and in uh, well, well, the main progression that's used in the verse. Okay, E, C sharp minor, B, A. It's like a descending kind of thing. Let's quickly jump into the chords here. So I go to the seventh fret over here, seventh fret. First finger, seventh fret, and then ninth fret with these two fingers. And then all the other strings open. So seven, nine, nine. There we go. So that's our E chord. And then what we're going to do with the strumming is we're going to strum like this strum pattern going like this, just down strums, going one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two. Slowly there will be. One two three one two three one two one two three one two three one two. So just count that on the E and just palm mute it. So to palm mute, you just karate chop your guitar right there on the bridge. Perfect. And get the sweet spot over there. It's too dead. Over there, it's too alive. You just gotta get that sweet spot. Okay. So once you got that sweet spot. You can start counting one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, one, two, three. And then once you got this going, you can take the index finger and take it down to the fourth fret to get C sharp minor. Loving can hurt. And then we're gonna go to the C sharp minor. Loving can hurt sometimes. This is at the fourth fret. Now you're gonna go to the two to get the B, which is the fifth chord. That I know. And then you go to the open fret to get the A. This is actually called the A sus 2, but we're gonna just say it's an A for now. It's they're kind of interchangeable most of the times. Okay, so that's it for the for the verse. E. When it gets hard. You know it can get hard sometimes But it's the only thing that makes us feel alive So pretty, pretty basic stuff, not, not rocket science E, C sharp, B, A Make sure you're taking notes Then for the pre-chorus oh, I can put this up here on the screen for you guys The pre-chorus, we've got C sharp minor, A, E, B So we start on the 4th fret for the C sharp minor a, 
E. Now I like to use this E this time. So you don't have to go all the way up to this E. So, so C sharp minor. And then E, B. Then the same thing again. Don't do that. That sound doesn't fit with the song. No closing hearts are never broken. Time's forever frozen and stale. Pretty basic, man. That's like that's like the pre-chorus. C sharp A E B. Okay. Then for the chorus E B C sharp A, the most popular. Chord progression ever played on pop music. So we got E. You can keep me inside the pocket if you rip jeans, holding my clothes until I eyes and meet. You won't ever be alone. Wait for me to come home. You don't have to do that, that's just actually the piano playing that kind of thing. And the guitar later, but it's just kind of a an extra little thingy there. Okay, then the rest of the song is exactly the same. The bridge part, which is just, just is basically the chorus, actually. So, E, B, C sharp, A for the chorus. So yeah, let's just review that quickly. The three progressions that you need to know. First one is the verse. Loving can heal. And then C sharp, learn can mend your soul. B A. Learn the only thing that I know. And then the pre chorus is with your C A E B. We keep this love in a photograph. We make these memories for ourselves. Da 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 Simple, simple stuff. And then the chorus, E, B, C sharp, A. Keep me inside the pocket. Okay, now I want to show you guys some cool different ways to play the B and the A and the C sharp. So if you're playing your E chord over here, you can just take the middle finger and put it on the 10th fret as well. Make sure to mute the 5th string. Then you've got your C sharp minor. So that's E and this is C sharp minor. I'm at the 7th fret over here. 7th fret, let's move this camera a little bit that way. So we got E, C sharp minor, E, C sharp minor. Okay, so E. And then B, you can take this E chord, take it up one string, and put the middle finger on the third string at the 8th fret. And that's your B, and then this is your A. Now you can also do a simplified version of the A, or a nicer version where you take these two notes. That's six and seven. That's a really nice A for me. I really like this A. So we got E. C sharp minor, and then B. Cool guys, I hope this tutorial has really helped you understand this song and know how to play it. But if you got the strumming pattern, you got the palm muting, you got the chords, you're good to go. Go jam out this song. Have a nice time. Mm -hmm.